Hello everyone. Good evening. Welcome to the Hindu editorial vocabulary reading and summary series presenting by Diction Addiction. Today's Hindu editorial title is Regulation Light on Self-Regulation Code for OTT Channels. Vocabulary and more importantly, what is OTT? Over the top, over the top. So over the top, OTT is a media service. So which, connect, which connects to the viewers directly, directly by, by bypassing the cables, satellites and etc. So media house to, media house to the viewer directly transfer. They can view the, this, they can enjoy the service by using the personal laptops or desktops or the mobile phones, which this content is available on the, their websites. Best examples are OTTs are Netflix, Amazon Prime and Artspot, Artstar, Disney and so on. Right now, around 40, more than 40 OTTs are operating in India. So you can imagine what is the business of OTT, why government wants to have a guidelines for this OTT. That's what is today's editorial. First, we will look at the uh, vocabulary because this is most important to understand the editorial. Hence, we must be thorough of vocabulary, then we will get the essence of the article in a, on fingertips. Otherwise, you have to struggle and compromise. The first one is light. Means it's an informal version of a light, L-I-G-H-T. Gauntlet, you see, gauntlet means a long, thick glove used for the protection, which is wearing for, which is wearing for hand to protect itself from the uh, harmful effects. Tacit means express understanding without expressing the feelings or words. Sometimes you will understand the feelings of others by looking at them. You won't tell that you understood or you don't say a word. There is no uh, communication to, to say that I understood. That is what is called tacit. Inexorable. Inexorable means impossible to stop or prevent. It's, it's a uncontrollable. Inexorable growth of growth of, growth in the uh, OTT sub, and their subscription and revenues means it's continuous. There is no stop. Is, we can't stop it because of a number of reasons. Infused means fill or a soak. Cross. No intelligence, stupid or insensitive. In, insensitive. Cross commercialism means the, that is whatever you say. Cross means no, they don't use any brain. Defiling means polluting, spoiling or tarnishing. Defiling, defiling means damaging the reputation. Portrayal means depicting or representation is called as portrayal. Derogatory means showing disrespectful attitude. Derogatory comments against the human, human or derogatory comments against the certain communities means you don't have respect. Whatever comes to your mind or whatever comes to your mouth, you are speaking that. That is what is called as a derogatory. Prejudice means biased. You treat someone with the highest respect and some, someone with the no respect. You, you will be rude. That's what is the biased. Partiality. Bigotry. Antiquated. Antiquated means 
It's a old one, old ideas, not updated, obsolete, old passioned. Repugnant, repugnant, repugnant means extremely unacceptable or distasteable. Repugnant means pungent means actually bad smell. It doesn't have good good to good smell or that's here. Repugnant means very very bad. Plethora means many. Severe you know, many a surplus. Or excess, plethora of problems. Means excess in a number. That is what is called plethora. Egregious means egregious, egregious human. Human means extremely bad and shocking personality. Egregious humans are egregious activities. Means is shockingly bad. Unimpeachable means you can't find a fault with the person. That is what is called unimpeachable. Means perfect. Ek se ek. That is what is called unimpeachable. Not able to doubt. There is no problem with that person. Unquestionable. Flawless. Faultless. That is what is unimpeachable. Unimpeachable persons are not born, they are made. Monoculture. Monoculture means growing only one culture. Suppose you are, you are cultivating a, only one crop, crop is called as monoculture. Means you are allowing the one idea to survive and uh, survive and propagate. That is what is monoculture. So wherever is a diversity, then there are a number of culture, polyculture would be there. But if you are suppressing all of them and allowing to grow one culture, that is what is called monoculture. When you cut the forest, when you cut the forest, forest is having different types of trees, flora and fauna, and removing everything and and crop, you know, cultivating one crop, that is what is monoculture. Propaganda means negative information. Information, especially of biased or misleading, means you are biased to someone, you are favoring to someone, you are you are give, you are telling something positive about someone, and you are if you are against, you are giving a wrong feeding about other. That's what is a propaganda. Means no no accuracy. You are compromised with the accuracy authenticity. That is what is propaganda. Overbearing means you can't bear it. You feel very burden of that. That is what is called unpleasant overpowering, overpower, overbearing censorship. Whenever a person made a, a, a director makes the movie with his ideas, but it has to go through the pre censorship where they'll cut, they'll ask you to cut or trim the some scenes because they are not made right. So you feel burden and you can't accept. That is what is called overbearing. Bearing means acceptable. War means it is not acceptable. Taboo. Taboo means prohibited or restricted by the social custom. Few things you cannot do it in this country or in particular region, particular religion, because people are following so, some social customs. That is what is called taboo. It is there in the every field also. Taboo means you cannot touch it. Obscenity means very bad, not right one. Outrage, extremely anger or shock, you are shocked. Flourish means surviving and growing and developing happily and healthily. That is what is flourish. So the industry must flourish means it has to gain a lot of business and it has to get a lot of profits. The organisms are flourished in this condition means there are much many nutrients so that they are growing and dividing. The number is increasing. Someone is flourishing, flourishing, some organism is flourishing means what? Their number is getting increased because of environment is cooperating and they are eating, dividing, developing and their number is increased. That's what flourish. 
so i guess today's my word is ages means protection or backing a support so i i i go today i'll pick up the word is flourish for well, everyone has to flourish because as long as you are a human and you do work and you have to flourish there is nothing now some nobody can stop you to flourish because of sex because of caste because of religion because of region these should not be stop you to flourish anywhere you cannot over you have to overcome them and you have to flourish i like flourish word yeah now we come to the second section that is loud speaker where we will read the article with a big voice why we read because we are going to involve the article and we we'll forget the world and you try to understand and imbibe by reading also not not by thinking reading also help you to imbibe the essence yeah that's what we do like to do it reading under loud speaker india's internet based over the top streaming services have operationalized a code of self regulation from february 10 soon after the ib ministry announced that it had prepared a set of guidelines and directives for the industry the inexorable inexorable growth of ott channels has infused creative talent into film making aided by the absence of over bearing sensors and vested interest although it might be argued that it also has small minority pursuing cross commercialism covid-19 buoyed subscription revenues from home bound viewers for ott revenues ott ventures streaming films reality shows serials and documentaries and with the cinemas closed even broke the industry taboo against online first film releases at the urgency of this code arises not from any challenge to law and order or morality posed by the films but the gauntlet of police and court cases that filmmakers and the channels are now having to run governments are also lending tacit support to the view that creative expression may be becoming too influential to be left free the fir's fir's in up against the amazon prime video series thandau invoking legal legal provisions on cyber terrorism obscenity promoting social enmity and defiling place of worship on the ground that portrayal of god was a derogatory and a plain mp on the same series seeking a court direction to the court direction to bring ott channel under censorship laws indicate the growing oppressive environment it is a time the center took a firm stand against the displays of manufactured outrage and newer channels of creativity flourish the collective initiative of ott service under the aegis of internet and mobile association of india which places emphasis on abiding the ipc laws on women's and children rights copyright and age appropriate certification and parental control while uploading constitutional provision on free speech should be given an opportunity to work such voluntary code is consistent with the recommendations of ib ministry expert committee on film certification chaired by the sam benegal in 2016 the panel upheld creative expression and full ownership of any visual production leaving viewing decision to audiences more accurately classifying films by your age and ensuring transparency in the way reviewing bodies are constituted the idea that films must be pre pre censored and arbitrary cuts made by government appointed nominees mostly out of prejudice 
is antiquated and repugnant to liberal societies clearly a plethora of laws are available to assess based on complaints whether there has been a egregious violation of law and this determination ought to be made by unimpeachable bodies representing wide spectrum of civil society the police policed approach to films and media can go only grow monoculture of propaganda yeah this is what is the uh, some you know the readings reading one and we will move to the summary this is what is the summary uh, we will you know uh, ministry in a summary the first one i want to tell you here there are around 40 ott platforms are uh, operating in india why this a uh, guidelines or directives have come uh, for uh, ott because of the cases filed in the up and mp and uh, in the rajya sabha across the parties across the parties people uh, mps have asked to have a guidelines for ott and if you see i am sure that you might have seen the or not seen the uh, web series that is tando in the amazon prime video where uh, the the file the cases are filed in up against the cast and crew of cast and crew of the tando why because they say that two things one is there are derogative comments against the god and second thing is that even police has also filed a case in the upr mp saying that they are uh, they are uh, projecting the the tandav is projecting the police officers or police force in a wrong way means drinking the alcohol and compromising with the other people right and not only these two or three incidents you know people, government may be showing a number of incidents to uh, have a guidelines on the operationalization of the ott but if you look into the ott's how they are running ott is is free from the clutches of satellites tvs or other other mediators whatever you want to uh, whatever you want to view it's available in the ott uh platform and you can pay and you can view so you don't have to pay to the middleman it is directly from production to the viewer this is the best thing you on you know is enjoying at this moment but at the same time at the same time uh self regulation of, of ott has started but which is uh, which is on par with the shan bengal recommendation on the otts and shan bengal chaired committee said that whatever content which is visualized which is there on the ott it is up to the viewer to decide whether it is a good or bad right you you there, there must be a no censorship on that one right so this is all if you look into the article again the editorial says that Uh, it is against the you know it will kill the creativity of the young minds by create by keeping the censorship right that's what is uh, their uh, central idea hope oh, we will have a guidelines but which also preserves the freedom of speech as well as the promotion of the creativity of the young minds this is all i, I want to tell from this this editorial if at all you like it give thumbs up and for regular updates do subscribe uh this is all and thank you and sunday is holiday for diction addiction because of one reason is that there won't be any editorial on sunday issue in sunday hence we will take a break and uh, one more point i want to tell you here why would i choose one editorial only why not two because i'll prefer the editorial 
one uh, any one of the any one any one any two any one of any one because the one which is having more tough words and more new words then I, that i will choose that's the reason i'll choose only one whenever i see more tough words or more new words i'll be more happy to present if not that day would be boring so i choose the uh, choose i'll choose the editorial based upon the number of new words not the issue only new words new words new words means vocabulary is life to everyone to me also okay thank you all see you again on monday until then bye bye